Hi Cancer, welcome to your reading Cancer. In this reading we'll be focusing on your person, we'll take a look at their feelings, their actions, their intentions towards you, we'll take a look at your connection, we'll pull so some messages of love, some oracle cards and also we'll take a look what your person would like to confess to you, Cancer, okay? So let's take a look. What do we have for Cancer? Of whom Cancer is connecting with. We have the Eight of Cups. Whom Cancer is connecting, please. Today, could you please show Cancer's person? <laughs> Six of Cups. Okay. All right. Could you please show us more for Cancer? Cancer's person. bottom of the deck we have the Emperor. So Cancer, you might be dealing with Aries. I have strong uh, Pisces and your energy Cancer as well. Cancer, I feel that we are connecting today with someone who might be, dis uh, who might be at the distance with you, with, with who is detached uh, or who acts detached distance eight of cups i feel someone left the situation at the moment maybe there is a no communication between the two of you or no contact situation but the moon to the six of cups this person is very much thinking about you very deeply in their feelings and they do want to come back with the six of cups so we might be dealing with your ex or with someone with whom you have a strong soul connection and even a history with the six of cups this person wants to have a new beginning in love with you with the ace of cups the problem is that they are very stubborn with the emperor and that stubbornness it's creating barriers represented by the eight of swords absolutely this is a mindset I feel that your person likes to be in control. This is someone who likes to be in control, who, who, who wants to be respected. Decision, many options, kings, kiss on a ring we have. I'll tell you the other story in a minute, Cancer, because they told me this. Okay, and we have sunglasses, watching, looking, <laughs> yeah. And we have go with the snake, empath, narcissist, uh, being charmed, boundaries, unable. Okay, so Cancer, for some of you, this is someone who you might have known for some time, and this person has hidden feelings for you okay this is a secret admirer for some of you and this person would very much like to have a new a beginning in love with you let's say but they feel unable to do that that's why I feel that you might not be in a communication with this person but I have of course previous scenario as well so please take it at it, at it resonates okay because it won't resonate. We are connecting here with collective energy, so we'll have many scenarios. And cross watchers, you are very much welcome, but please take a note that it might play from your perspective, so the, the situation can be switched, or roles can be switched, okay? So it might be your situation with regards to cancer. Nevertheless, I very strongly feel, Cancer, that, some, that someone left the situation. This person is very heavily thinking about you. They want to come back. They want to reconcile with you. They want to apologize. Please take it that it resonates with the Six of Cups. They want to have a new beginning, but they feel unable because this person is controlling. I feel with this. Uh, with, with the keys and sunglasses this person is heavily watching you okay but I also feel that at some point they made you feel that you are an option not a priority and you might have experienced gaslighting okay and also 
I feel that you might felt being used by this person, that they charmed you and uh, somehow they disappoint you on a higher level. Okay. For your connection, I have a King of Cups. Let's take a look at your connection, Cancer, please. Could you show me Cancer's connection with their person, please? We have a Nine of Cups and we have a Nine of Pentacles, yes. You are, you are, you are showing here as an empath and in Girl with the Snake card, it is this dynamic empath, uh, empath and kind of someone who might have narcissistic tendencies. So if that's the case, please take it that it resonates, okay? King of Cups, you are presented here by the King of Cups. Also, you might be dealing with another Cancer. You might be dealing with Scorpio or Pisces. You do have enormous amount of feelings for this person, I feel. You are very, you are very a kind, very gentle. You have so much love to give. I feel with this King of Cups. Mutual energy is Nine of Cups. I feel that both of you see each other as a wish fulfill of seeing each other. Okay, please take it that it resonates. However, the, it is also this energy of, I feel Cancer that you are very proud and you try and you just uh, showing, I feel the world that you're doing all right, if it is no contact situation. You know that you are that you are okay you have a dignity you are you are fine because king also is sitting on his throne kings are very passive energies very very passive energies and they represent emotions logic it depends on the king king of cups he's very emotional but he also represents this very rare ability to have uh, to keep balance between mind and and heart and I feel that you are representing it you you are showing us with 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 the king of cups as someone who is very um, very grounded very balanced who has enormous amount of love to give but also who is very smart about it okay and that's why I feel that you try to appear that you know whatever the case might be you are doing all right you have dignity you are very proud and it's fine it's fine you know it's okay you are not chasing anyone here on this side we have a nine of pentacles this person seems to have a very strong sense of independent independence so you might be dealing with someone who is uh, who is scared of commitment or who just likes that kind of lifestyle but there is a selfish element about them represented by the nine of pentacles it wouldn't surprise me that that you, you know you might feel that this person it's all about themselves at the bottom of the deck, we have the death card. Something ended here, I indeed, with regards to this connection. This is, this is, this is another kind of confirmation for me that we are connecting. For most of you, with regards to, uh, with person with whom you might have an ending. And this is a Scorpio energy, so you might be dealing with the Scorpio cancer but ended something ended here between the two of you and something is changing as well you know i feel we're doing indeed someone walked away and now your person i feel they do want to come back we have the six of cups they feel very nostalgic about you they are thinking about good old times and they do want to have they want to come back to offer you a cup of love but they feel somehow blocked. Let's take a look, Cancer. What's your person would like to confess to you? What Cancer's person would like to confess to them, please? We have. I feel you leaving me behind. We have. I am becoming a better person. 
I, bur I bury myself in work to forget you. Mm -hmm. You didn't see my tears. Okay. This person is heavily observing you, especially with the sunglasses. At the bottom of the deck, we have, I'm starting to understand our connection. What well, they do feel, I, I, don't, I don't doubt that they feel that it is strong strong soul connection with the six of cups but it, well, the question is if it's enough <clears throat> excuse me they feel this disconnection this this i mean this this you being uh probably just not giving them much attention and they, and they wanted to say, I feel you leaving me behind. They're trying to convince you that they are becoming a better person because they recognize, especially with these cars, that, you know, that uh, there is a quite selfish energy about them. This person might be very much focused on their work at the moment in order to distract themselves from that very strong feeling. And... Uh, distract themselves from thinking about you work is quite important i feel for this person so it wouldn't surprise me that they would start working a lot or trying to distract their mind from from their feelings you didn't see my tears well they're claiming that you know that as much as they're trying to maybe you know this person might have a very strong exterior and trying to be all um alpha male alpha female kind of energy because i feel I can't remember, but I feel we had a emperor at the bottom of the deck for them, so that would make sense. Someone who is very, uh, you know, wants to be in a position of power that sh shouldn't show much of a softer side to the world. And they saying, "Well, you didn't see my tears, but I cried, so please take it that it resonates. That, that that's what they want you to know." I'm starting to understand our connection, Cancer. They do, they do. They do because they're thinking a lot about you. So there is indeed this this energy of it. Let's take a look. They are they are observing your social media, watching, looking, stalking. Absolutely. Let's take a look at your connection. Could you please show cancer some messages of love with regards to their connection and for cancer? we have release okay and we have apology you deserve apology cancer here and now and they should act now the thing is the spirit is emphasizing that you should focus on yourself and i feel that's what you're doing you are not chasing anyone you're trying to be balanced here and now you're focusing on your life at the moment that's what is important i feel with these cards for you release apology you can expect the apology you want to hear so spirit is saying that you know this person might indeed make a move we'll take a look later i mean at the moment in a moment <laughs> but there is something that you need to release and we'll see if it is a person this person in order for you to kind of fully focus on yourself or to release whatever the case might be we have we have for your connection the death card which shows that you know something ended between the two of you and maybe needs releasing well let's take a look Cam. so let's take a look let's take a look at your purses not too many now i want to clarify the release card could you please give me what is this release for cancer? What do they need to release with regards to their connection with their person? What's that? We have Ace of Wands. We have a Seven of Swords. And we have an Eight of Wands. And let me... We have a Four of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Cancer, you have a new beginning. There is a new energy who, which wants to come forward. And the thing is that uh, 
the spirit is saying here in order if you want to you know be with this person or give them a chance because some of you will and I completely understand why uh, I completely understand that you would want to do that to 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 to, uh, to to accept an apology of course and you know reconcile with this person because you do have an enormous amount of love for them but I do feel cancer that in order to do that you need to release um, how can I say I feel that it will be difficult for you to fully give this person another chance I will say it that way because there are some trust issues between the two of you I feel you do have a trust issues because this person lied to you they were sneaky okay and and if you want to give them another chance and to have this four of wands that the spirit is saying well that you need to release this 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 kind of a suspicion that you might be carrying uh, with regards to your your connection with your person okay that's what I see guys I hope it resonates for some for, for some of you okay so the spirit emphasized to, to release mm, maybe not like that maybe to that you should maybe oh, not should I mean um, that it's important to um, it's important to to enter this connection if you want to give it another chance uh, with a like a with a new energy a new approach to not hold to the old okay I really hope that it that it makes sense guys <laughs> okay let's take a look at your person's feelings could you please show me cancer's person's feelings do you please show me cancer's person's feelings we have a four of cups please show me this person cancer's person's feelings for cancer please we have the two of cups mm -hmm. and we have the temperance sagittarius energy cancer cancer the, the oh my gosh look at the bottom of the deck we have the lovers gemini energy oh my gosh this person wants to be with you here and now <laughs> they do they love you and they are full of regret the way they treated you they kind of now realizing that they did you wrong they brought dissatisfaction disappointment you were trying very hard to make this person happy nothing was good enough I feel and they very much thinking about what they have done and they are unhappy I can tell you they are unhappy why because they want to be with you they love you they want to have two of cups this person I feel very strongly that we are dealing with someone with with, with whom you might have falling out or you, you you someone from your past someone who left the, the the relationship the connection there was an ending and this person wants to come back this is very prominent here very clear message they are unhappy nothing is satisfied nothing satisfies this person at the moment they are unhappy they are thinking about this three of cups that they had with you joy happiness fulfillment celebration i feel they shared lots of beautiful they have many memories very beautiful memories but uh, that you that you know with you and and they really really thinking about those memories and they are very unhappy and regretful why because i feel that it is indeed a no contact situation or contact is very till the minimum very very small between the two of you they want to be with you cancer the two of cups this person loves you at the bottom of the deck overall energy the lovers more love very strong soul connection 
this person loves you, Gemini energy and temperance. They want to reconcile. <laughs> temperance, Sagittarius energy. They want to reconcile, they want to bring balance to the situation. They want you. They want to be with you. They love you. Let's take a look, Cancer. Very, very clear message. Let's take a look at their intentions, Cancer. Could you please show me Cancer's person's intentions towards them? This connection. We have a King of Pentacles. We have the Ten of Pentacles. And we have a six of pentacles. Oh my gosh. They want stability. That's the intentions. You might be dealing with the earth sign. Cancer. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. They want, they want, they want happily ever after with you. Ten of pentacles. Long term stable relationship. We have all pentacles in their intentions. They want stability. They want long term commitment. They want something. They just want you for a long term. Let's say that way. And they are very kind of fixated on this. That's what they want. They just want this. That's the intention. Let's take a look at the actions. Could you please show me Cancer's person's actions to use them for the immediate future? We have mm -hmm, the lovers. I'm sorry, this is my dog. <laughs> He's snoring. <laughs> we have the Four of Pentacles in their actions and we have the hanged man. At the bottom of the deck we have a Four of Wands. Cancer, this person, we have again Gemini energy, I have Pisces energy. This person doesn't want to let you go. That's it. They are. Cancer is my person and I don't want to let. They, 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 they feel that you're leaving them behind. And, and they are, I feel they are even more motivated to do something about it. in their actions this person is very stubborn cancer they are very stubborn they, they 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 will come forward they would want it to you know i feel that indeed you know we have overall energy the four of wands maybe it is a twin flame connection we have the lovers we have a six of cups quite strong soul connection i have to say two of cups i feel this person will make a move to reconcile with you they do, they are very much, they want this, that's it. They stick to it with the Four of Pentacles, the Hangman. The thing is, Cancer, that it is important that this person is bringing a new energy, new attitude, okay? Because uh, they might very, you know, they might love you and I don't doubt that, but this person has some sort of, um, it's, this person can be quite complex, okay, stubborn, they think that they know best, They this is my way or no way, they need to kind of change, they need to change this, but they will make initiative with the lovers, I feel that they will come forward, you will hear from them, or they will ask you out, or they will... They will ask, you know, to if there is a chance for you to meet up. They will make a move. They want you. That's it. Four of Pentacles, Hangman. That's it. They want you. Four of Wands, reconciliation. But there is something about this person that they, they are very stubborn, and that can affect this connection. A bit selfish energy again. Okay, let's take a look, Cancer, for your outcome. Could you please show me in for immediate future, for a near future, outcome for Cancer's connection with their person? We have the devil. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Overall, we have the chariot. Cancer, this person is obsessing over you. They are looking at your photos. They are looking at your social media. 
they're obsessing that you are not giving them attention that you just focusing on yourself and I am sure you're looking great you're attracting attention you just you just you know you act completely not bothered and that person is a bit I think they are kind of oh, that that really makes them feel unsure about the situation the devil this person doesn't want to let you go and they and I feel that they will make attempts to reconcile or to talk to you or to just be next to you they are obsessing over you they are already attached and that's it this is a Capricorn energy but there is something unhealthy about this person okay and indeed, you might be dealing with someone who has narcissistic tendencies, who is very charming, who knows exactly what to say, but who is just a control freak, who like to be chased, you know, who might have tendency to gaslight. I'll tell you one thing cancer when I see these cards and I'll be very honest with you and when I see card release I know that what it, we, we pull some cards about the release card and it says that if you want to give the same chance you know another chance sorry for your person that be sure that you just you know you, you're bringing a completely new energy but the thing is, Cancer, that for, for some of you, the best idea would be to just release this person. Because as much as the love, it's strong, and I feel they, they indeed want you, this is a bit of a selfish love, okay? Represented by the devil. Because we do have a lover, but then we have the Four of Pentacles, the Hanged Man, we have the Nine of Pentacles. This is very kind of selfish. They are very stubborn. And they have, there is something unhealthy about the situation. And for in the immediate future, you know, this person wants to have a control. They want to have a control over situation, over this connection. I feel they also, you know, this person, you know, the. I don't know, but I, I, I feel I, I, they're telling me that, you know, that, that maybe they put you in this kind of a chase around a dynamic and they put you, they made you feel that you have to compete for them. Okay. For their attention, or you were just worried and stressing out that this person might be interested in someone else. They were kind of. Man this is a manipulative energy they do want to have a long-term commitment with you but again this is something mm, I don't like this devil energy at the, at the, at, at the end of, of this reading I don't like that with these cards it, it, it seems that this person loves you loves you because it is but it's a, it's a selfish love and they somehow feel inability to change but the thing is that it's just a mindset of course that you know they can change it's just up to them but I feel that they don't want to change because it's convenient for them okay for your overall energy for this reading we have the chariot and this is your energy cancer you will have to make a choice what to do i i feel that chariot is a victory card this is a card which is shows strength and courage and also a very action oriented card the main message is with this card for your overall energy for this reading is that it will be your ultimate decision as much as this person might project uh, that energy that you know they are in, in some sort of advantage or you know that they are in in, in control of the situation they are not the spirit is saying no you are in control because this is your card the, the ultimate decision is yours 
if you want to welcome this person back to your life or reconcile with them or if you want to choose a completely different direction and say what it's done it's done and I just want to I just want to move on okay so decision will be yours cancer what you will do with the situation this person they do love you but this is a very unusual love let's say that way a bit selfish I have to say they thinking about you and they do want to reconcile with you you have an apology it wouldn't surprise me that this person would and, and lovers in their actions that this person will make a move and try to reconcile with you or, or apologize for something that they have done because they are attached and they just don't want to let you go they want you but the decision is yours what you will do with it thank you very much for being with me cancer please like share and subscribe and i truly hope that this reading was of help um i have um i've received in your um comments which i'm very grateful for thank you for for, for leaving a comment uh, asking about what sort of um tarot deck i'm using so this is uh deborah blake's red in oh, deck sorry <laughs> and it calls everyday witch so these are the cards that i'm using for your readings they are very kind of gentle kind um, very sweet energy cards oh, they didn't work for me anyway <laughs> all tarot cards are beautiful and wonderful but these are i can feel them quite well that's why I'm, I'm using those so these are the cards that i'm using okay cancer thank you very much once again for being with with me and please take care thank you bye, bye.